All right, guys, I just wanted to jump on here real quick and get in touch with you. Um, probably the easiest way to communicate this message to you. I was just up at Pius and sat down with some of the teachers and was just kind of going over progress and how everybody's doing. Um, and to be honest, I'm, I'm really disappointed in uh, the feedback that I got from the teachers um, on some of us. And, and it's not all of us, but um, we're a team. And uh, guys, I want to make it clear right now that my expectation is for us to be champions. It's not just on the field, okay? It's, it goes way beyond that. It, you, you need to be a champion in the classroom. And um, for instance, some of us are in, in jeopardy of even being eligible. And I don't care if you're eligible. If you're not being a champion in the classroom, I will not let you play, period. That's how this works. Um, you represent yourself. You represent your family. You represent your football team, your teammates. You represent us coaches everywhere you go. And when you're in that classroom, I look at you're representing me in that classroom. And when I walk through that school, I plan on walking through that school with my head high because I know all you guys are going to do what it takes to be a champion in the classroom, on the football field, and out in regular life. So, guys, this whole thing that we're doing, it's more than just football. Okay, It's not just about football. We're working out. We're doing great. We're doing all this stuff, the Zoom meetings. It's more than that. It's got to be more than that. And you guys got to commit to it because – until we do that, guys, it, it doesn't matter. We can have the absolute best talent on the field and still not win and still not be champions, okay? We have to buy into this whole thing for this to work. So for those of you guys that are not getting in the classrooms, that aren't going to class, you know, when there's a, when there's a class, when there's a class being held in a meeting, there's no excuse to miss it. Get in the classroom. I do not want to hear another teacher come to me and say, hey, so-and-so football player couldn't make it to class. They said, oh, they don't have internet. They don't have this. I don't want to hear excuses. Get to class. Get it done. And guys, I'm not joking when I say, if I don't hear this improving, I will cut off all football. There will be, there will be zero workouts. There will, be, there will be no football going on until we get our stuff taken care of in the classroom. I don't want to do it, but I promise you I will do it if I have to. Get in the classroom. Get your work done. Be respectful. Thank your teachers. Do not have an excuse for or any reason why you missed something. Get in the classroom. Turn in your homework. There is no excuse. Turn in your homework. Okay. For those of you that are behind in your classes, that have low grades, Go to your teachers, apologize, tell them you're sorry for not doing the work that you should have. Be responsible, take accountability and say, hey, I did it. I didn't, I wasn't doing what I was supposed to do. Take the accountability and then assure that teacher, I promise you, I want to do this. I'm going to do better for you. Let them know that and then ask them, what can I do to get my grade up? I do not want to have another video like this. Because the next video I have with this will be saying, hey, we're done doing football until we get our grades up. I don't care. I know this is a big change for a lot of us. It's not an excuse. Do not look at it and look for an excuse. Look at it for a reason to step forward, to get better, to gain ground on the competition, to get your grade even higher. Get in the classroom. Do your homework. Get your assignments turned in on time, not late, not on time, early. Okay? I do not want to walk into that school and get another report like I got today. Get it together. And for those of you guys that need help that aren't good with getting on class from whatever it is, get the help. We're here to help. I've already sent out some emails today. I'm here to help. If you guys need help, reach out to me. Let me know. Any of us coaches will help you guys with anything that we can. There is no excuses here. Okay, This is bigger than football. This is bigger than football. If you need help, let us know, okay? Get in the classroom. Get it done, all right? I don't want to have another video like this, all right, guys? Because we've been doing so great. We're doing great with what we're sending you out, okay? For the most part, we're starting to get closer to that 100 from 100 thing. And, and th guys, this is going to apply for the classroom too, okay? Get in, get it done, 
All right, and I want to see this thing turned around so the next week when I go up there and and, and I sit down, because I'm, I'm going to get all the reports now. I'm getting in the Google Classrooms. They're giving me access to every classroom to see who's showing up, who's turning in assignments. I'm going to have everything that I need to call you out if I have to call you out, okay? So get in, get your homework done. That's the first thing you do. And, and I don't want you doing a football workout or a football install before you get your homework done. Get your homework done first, okay? Get your school taken care of and get it turned in, all right? All right, guys, the, not another one like this. Commit to it and let's get it done, okay? We were on the right path, but it's got to be every aspect of life, all right? Let's go, guys. Get it done.